All right, guys, so today I am going to show you my line progression of my pregnancy test, and I also have some ovulation test strips, as you can see here. So on the ovulation test strips, you will always have two lines, regardless if it's positive or negative. <clears throat> Excuse me. But if it's not a positive ovulation, this first line, the test line, is not going to be anywhere near as dark as the second line. And as soon as it starts getting as dark or darker than the control line, that's when you have a positive. And a positive in these tests means that you have an LH hormone surge. And in order to ovulate, you need that surge in LH hormone to release the egg. Now, as you can see here, I got some positives here and I think that I ovulated, I'm pretty sure, on March 1st. Because usually when you get a positive, you ovulate 12 to 24 hours later. So my first positive was on February 28th, and then March 1st I took two, and we um, had sex these days here, and a little bit before as well. And then, eight days later, you guys are going to think I'm crazy, but... I did see a line on these, and these are the pregnancy tests that came in the package with my ovulation test strips. And they're very affordable, you get them on Amazon. So as soon as I saw those very, very faint lines, I went to a more reliable test, the first response, and I was 8 DPO when I tested, and I got a pretty substantial line there. And we've got 9 DPO. 10 DPO, 11, 12, you can see the test line is now darker than the control line. I skipped 13 and went to 14, same, um, test line is darker than control line. And then I had one of these off-brand tests and I took it on 17 DPO and you can see that that test line is much darker. Oh, excuse me, I'm so out of breath. <clears throat> anyway, we've got 90 DPO with the clear blue test, 11, 12 DPO, and then 7 DPO. And you can see that now the test line is very dark as well, or at 17 DPO it was. We've got a 90 DPO on these cheap tests from Walmart. They're like 86 cents. 10 DPO, 13, 15, 18 DPO, and there's just a nice darkening of the test lines. And then this one I took today, I am five weeks. So thank you for watching, that's my test line progression. And I really just did this uh, to show my viewers and to get a good idea um, that my HCG, human chorionic gonadotropin, was uh, raising in my blood as the days went on. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.